Hello, in this quick demo video, I'm going to show you how you can install the Pop-Up Ninja plugin on your website. So I have this default WordPress theme installed on your on your website. So what I'm doing is I'm just heading to the dashboard area and under the plugins, I'm going to install a new plugin. I'm clicking the add new button and I'm just pressing this upload button. I'm choosing this file of Pop-Up Ninja and I'm just opening it and installing it. After the plugin is successfully installed, I'm just activating the plugin. So you can see right here in the dashboard panel, there is a Pop-Up Ninja tab right here. So once you have this tab, all you need to do is just click here and create Pop-Up. You can put any Pop-Up name. I'm just putting out my first pop-up test under the description you can just write anything that you want for the description of the pop-up under the content I had already written few content which I knew it, which I'm just copying paste in right here I'm, I have written want a glimpse at the SEO strategies of the biggest most successful in the world look over my shoulder today's step guide for free and under the subtitle I'm just putting the get your copy now subtitle under the description text you can put anything that you like I'm just not putting out anything what next I'm doing is I'm just putting out some bullet points that I want to do I'm adding few other bullet points Uh, now this is the form name field uh, text, text box where you can actually put up any name, any email address that you want or you can put up anything that you want on your buttons. Next I am going to the display settings and here are a few of the settings that you can choose from that how long the delay before the pop-up should appear and do you want to show the pop-up every time or just one time and on which particular page do you want to have the pop-up shown. You can choose any of these things that you want to do. I'm just choosing everywhere because I want to show this pop-up every time, everywhere on any every page of my website. Next, in the template and colors, you can choose any possible template that you want. I have this template one as chosen. So this is the main title. This is the uh, tagline. And these are few of the key points that I want to describe. And after this, I'm choosing the green color. So this is how the green color looks. And I just love this color. So I'm just choosing this color and I'm saving the changes. After the changes are saved, I'm visiting my website. And I would just, uh, as a normal visitor, I'm just browsing your website. And now I can see that a pop-up had appeared. It says, want a glimpse of the SEO strategies? Get your copy now. I can put out my name. I can put out my email address and if I like this thing I will just subscribe it after subscribing the pop-up closed down automatically and you might have the email address of the subscriber into your Aweber or any account that you like now next whenever you can see under the mailing list you can connect any of the API's that you want you can connect this pop-up to MailChimp, Aweber, eye contact constant contact get response or uh, on the online server what you need to do is once you press this connect to Aweber what button it will ask you your username and password once you fill up your username and password all you need to do is save the changes and it would make all the mailing list appear right here then you can just select any of the mailing list where you want to save your email addresses and just after selecting the mailing list just save the changes right here after saving the changes everything would be saved and any contact that you might have entered would automatically go into one of those the services thanks for watching this video this plugin is really very simple to use and you can literally see your subscriber space growing overnight thanks for watching this video